This week begins my month of chartering in Bimini, Bahamas. I have been coming to this island since as a baby, and to be able to share the places I love was extremely special. I really hope you enjoy the next few episodes. They are full of underwater shots, and I don't think I've ever spent so much time in the water in one month. I would also like to add that as I did multiple charters at a lot of the same locations, I have included bits and pieces of each charter throughout the next two episodes. We've had a crazy day of getting the boat ready. I didn't really film any of it, but she got a good wash at the dock. We just left the dock and anchored, and we have our first guest on. Hey, uh. <laughs> And we're gonna have an amazing six days of this beautiful water. And hopefully a lot of sharks. I can't tell you the last time I made coconut rice, but I happened to, so I'm so happy I did so just for your reaction. It was so was good. <laughs> so I'm gonna take a brief pause here. Mako's being very chatty. Huh? Yes. <laughs> because I partnered with My Heritage for this episode because I've always been asked, what is your DNA? What is your background? And the truth is I have absolutely no idea. So I'm gonna take a DNA test from my heritage and reveal what my ancestral background actually is. I just received my DNA kit and the instructions are super simple. Everything you need is in the box, such as the instructions, the envelope to send it back, the swabs and the test tubes. My heritage covers more regions than any other test, covering 2,114 genetic regions and 42 ethnicities. I'm gonna take the test now. I'm going to swab the inside of one of my cheeks for 30 to 60 seconds. And that is gonna go into the biohazard bag, seal it, and they sent an envelope a process super easy so now it takes about four weeks to get my results I'm sitting here editing and I checked my email and I just now received my DNA results from my heritage so we are gonna go open them together 46.9% Irish Scottish and Welsh 33.8% North and Western European. I can't say I'm surprised about that one. 15.8% Balkan. Would not have thought that. And, okay. Can't say I'm super surprised with these results, but it is so much fun to finally know what my background is and I'm seriously so excited about it. My Heritage holds a large database with over 19 billion historical records. Once you receive your DNA, you can discover all of your matches, start building your family tree, and search through these records. I haven't added all of my family yet, but I find this to be a really cool database to begin research on my family origins. So if you'd like to find out your own DNA, the link is in the description box with a coupon code for free shipping and you can get 30 day free trial at myheritage.com. So everything is in the description box and go check them out. It's truly worth it to find out what your heritage is. Our first stop is an island a few miles south of Bimini. It is widely known and loved among cruisers for its beautiful waters and a perfect beach. However, the best part is all of the stingrays that call this beach home. 
I would like to note that most of the rays still have their barbs and a safety briefing is given before entering the water to maximize respect of the rays, although they clearly don't understand personal space. of those stingrays and it was absolutely insane. How was it? So good! It was pretty amazing. It was a good day here. So we just left Honeymoon Harbor and it was amazing. Like, beautiful. Felt so good to be there. I love it. Okay, how's everyone feeling? Great. Can't wait Let's for this. Get him <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you guys don't have to get in right now. I'm gonna go ahead. We already got one hammer. Allie's in the water, and I'm gonna go safety her and make sure it's all good. And then everyone else is gonna get in. Okay, so I have not been vlogging much. It has been an amazing charter. We're about halfway through. Um, today's been great. Yesterday the hammerhead dive was amazing. Today's been also amazing. I didn't vlog anything this morning. I just took my GoPro. So we did a little drift dive. It was supposed to be a wreck. 
like a fun shipwreck, free dive, spearfish, but the current was ripping. But we got bull sharks, a huge turtle, and possibly a glimpse of a whale, possibly. I'm getting eaten alive by jellyfish. Apparently I'm allergic to a parasite that's in some of them. I'm so excited to be here in Bimini and there's so much to offer, so much life, and every day is amazing. It feels so good to be in the water every day and moving the boat every day. But Mako, guess who's coming today? Mako, guess who's coming today? So it's about 4.30, 5 p.m. My parents and my grandfather left Fort Lauderdale this morning around 11 a.m. and they are pulling into Anchorage right now. So we're gonna move and we're gonna be anchored together tonight. They're gonna be here for three or four nights. So two of the nights I do have charter and won't be spending a lot of time with them, but they brought some more goodies for me, like some more cameras and um, some other stuff, but I'm so excited to spend time with them. Tomorrow is hammerhead dives, and then we're gonna move back into the marina for deboarding day. Okay, and it's gonna be time for dinner, moving, and all of that. to do hammerhead round number two today. The conditions are stunning. It's gonna be so beautiful today. We'll have about six hours of water time on and off and it's super excited. Every winter, great hammerheads travel through this island. The renowned Bimini Shark Lab and Neil Watson Scuba Center discovered this spot in migration years ago and it has become a bucket list destination for many divers. I have been diving with sharks my entire life and these specific sharks for six years. Ali and I are both experienced shark divers and have a high understanding of their behavior. We had some beautiful interactions with these sharks throughout the month and while I will not be hosting any more charters here, I do have some points of contact to dive with these sharks in the description. At the end of the trip, we went to a local conch bar to relax and relive some of the highlights of the trip. It's a really special final night that we enjoy sharing with our guests before deboarding the next morning. After our guests left, we spent the day with my parents, visiting the rays, catching some lobster, and attempting to catch some fish, which all ended with a fun night at the dock. Driving and haven't picked up the GoPro, but we are headed back to the stingrays. A beautiful day out, and my drone just found the water, so that's how today is going to. When I can't see.
taking over the wives yes. so that they can have fun tonight. We got We're, too much lobster. Jack and I are here for moral support for Tom and Randy. Randy's cooking the sauce. We're good watchers. <laughs> We're doing great though. <laughs> I believe it. Yeah. We have a little break in between charters and we have a few more days, but the ocean is absolutely glass today again. And so Allie and I are gonna go out and um, maybe try to shoot some dinner and um, hopefully, and then use the carcass for some shark action today. Um, either way, it's gonna be a beautiful day out in the water and we're taking a little break from editing and then tomorrow we'll do laundry, groceries, and everything else.
have the speaker off. We just had the most gorgeous day. Just been literally sitting out in this water all day, enjoying it. And I hope you enjoyed this special time. Please subscribe and turn on that notification bell for another fun, busy week underwater in the next episode. I would like to say thank you to Allie for helping out with these, and if you are interested in visiting Bimini, I have linked some local operators in the description. Mm -hmm.